Rifle Head of Mission and Force Commander Major General Michael Berry is ending his two-year tour of duty to Lebanon. I think during the period we've been very lucky to enjoy operational calm, uh, no major incidents. Uh, we've made a lot of changes here in the mission and I believe that we can turn to the Security Council and we can say we are achieving our mission on your behalf in South Lebanon. My first service here was in 1982 and then subsequently in 1989, 94, 95 and now again for this extended period. So there's a part of Lebanon in me and I think a part of me in Lebanon. In contrast to his first tour of duty during the time of war, the current assignment witnessed an overall calm unprecedented in modern history of South Lebanon. Well, Unifil obviously plays its part as a peacekeeping mission here. But I think the real success has got to be with the parties. We have had in 2017 three times more tripartite meetings than we would have in a normal year. And that just demonstrates clearly how determined the parties are to keep the peace. Over the past year, there has been an increase in the number of troops from the Lebanese armed forces working alongside Unifil troops in South Lebanon. As Major General Michael Berry points out, this will benefit peace and stability in the long run. Probably one of the biggest things we can do is helping to build the capacity of the Lebanese armed forces. They are our strategic partners. They are very much present in South Lebanon. They are doing a fine job with us. We need to keep building that. And I'm very happy to think, as I depart from UNIFIL and my responsibility here, that next year we will have teenagers in South Lebanon, 13 years old, who will have not seen what conflict looks like in this part of the world. And I think that's what we all need to work towards.